welcome to another video so excited for today's video for the next at least day or so i'm gonna be bringing you along with me for just a regular day in my life they are my favorite like home vlogs are my favorite so that's exactly what i want this to be because those are my favorite videos to watch and i'm sure like as i do them more often i will get better at them but welcome to the first home vlog i actually need to shoot a campaign for amika which i am really excited about i'm obsessed with amika and i can't believe i get a partner with them all of 2024 it is like a dream come true for me so i'm really excited and grateful for that partnership i actually already filmed half of my video during the day because i wanted to go to the sephora store to like film the first part of the video so that went really great and then i came home and made pasta for my husband and i but tomorrow i'm gonna like actually take you along with me through my day the whole thing i filmed a youtube video um for my other channel which is like more reactions so i ranked the best rom-coms of the 2000s it's really fun it was like a tier ranking list did not feel like working out and i'm doing 75 hard right now so if i don't feel like working out i'll try and take myself on at least like a mile walk i walked my dog for about a mile and a half today which was awesome and it was sunny outside which is great it was still like 30 degrees but it was sunny so it was worth it and that was super fun i'm just excited for 20 i'm excited for 2024 i feel like it's going to be a really great year and in honor of 2024 i would love to hear some of your goals for the new year what you have planned if you have anything exciting if you're getting married if you're pregnant like i want all the tea i want it piping hot in the comments so let me know. Good morning, you guys, and welcome to today's vlog. I am so excited, like I mentioned last night for the vlogs today i think it's going to be just so fun i have so much there's so much dog hair in my house right now snowba is shedding a lot i think it's gonna be super fun and i'm just really excited i made my morning matcha which is so good it's literally just matcha i'll link my favorite matcha powder below and then i add some maple syrup to sweeten it and then i just do it with raw milk and it is freaking it's amazing i got the matcha we got the nova girl next to us hanging out because she's our bestie she always puts her hand on me like you can see um i always start off my mornings with a gratitude journal so i love this five minute journal sometimes i'll literally just do it in my notes like if i'm traveling i'll just if i remember write down a few things that I'm grateful for. This journal is cool because it has like what time did you wake up today, which today I think I woke up at nine. Um, when we went to Hawaii, my sleep schedule just got so messed up. Cause I, this whole year, it's a goal of mine to like get on track to wake up at like six, 6.30 ish. Like seven at the latest on those days when I need extra sleep. But that means going to bed at like 9. But it's hard because you're not tired. But then like to wake up the next morning when you're trying to like switch your sleep schedule is just like a whole thing. I actually woke up earlier yesterday than I did today. But that's okay. I think I slept about eight and a half hours though. So I'm like very strict about my sleep and i have to make sure i get enough i did not sleep very good last night and i can just feel it like my eyes have the craziest gnarliest bags under them need to do some eye patches today after my morning workout and like a sauna usually helps a ton kind of just get the helps to get the day going <laughs> share with you guys what I wrote today in my journal 
So it's pretty cool because it asks you some cool prompts, which I think prompts are great, especially if you don't know where to start, which is why I love this journal so much. But I wrote, I'm grateful for nights of good sleep, my job and the creativity that I have with it, quality foods to nourish my body, because I've been doing 75 hard and it's been really hard, but I feel like now it's kind of it's starting to just be like normal for me to like not eat sugar and not eat gluten and um you know all those not eat just processed food in general and it's been really hard but i've also been able to make like certain adjustments so that i'm like enjoying food but if i have like pasta it's gluten-free pasta and i found a pasta that doesn't hurt my stomach which is really great. Like just like small little wins like that make me so happy. Speaking of pasta, I really want to learn to make my own pasta, but that's a whole thing. Um, and then things I will do for my well-being well and health today is I wrote a workout and sauna session, which I write that almost every single day. Um, walk outside with Nova Girl because it's sunny outside. I only will walk with her outside if it's sunny because I, that's actually not true. I think I'm just sick of it now, like when it's like snowing outside and we're walking and like, it's so cold out there, but it feels actually really great. It's probably like, Alexa, what's the temperature in Salt Lake City, Utah today? Right now, in Salt Lake City, Utah, it's 34 degrees Fahrenheit. Today, expect a high of 48 degrees. Yeah, it's still, wow, it's, it's 35 degrees right now, or 34, but 48 is crazy for a high in February in Utah. Like that's, what the heck? Um, and then the last thing I did, I wrote, I'll do for my well-being and health is drink three Stanleys full of water. I don't even know what that equates to, but I forgot to do my mindful affirmation. So I think my mindful affirmation for today will be to be efficient with my time. I'm like, I can't even explain to you guys how, let me show you this really quick. Oh. I need to do my, my press on manicure kit. I wanted to talk to you guys about YouTube and because I've never been someone who posts consistently, probably until I started posting shorts end of last fall, beginning of last winter. It's never, YouTube's just never been something that I have put a lot of priority into mainly because I didn't want to and I think that's one thing that's cool about content creators is whatever platform they're on like you can tell that they are loving it and like I would say most of the time because they're not gonna do it if if they don't love it like if a tiktoker didn't like posting on tiktok then they'd probably be on youtube creating content I've just had this really fun drive and desire to be posting long-form video I don't know why but I just I'm like craving it like it's my favorite content to consume like I love watching YouTube videos I love the long format like I love the chattiness like shooting the shiz like I love that and I feel like that's what YouTube a lot of what YouTube is along with like storytelling and I feel like you just really get to know someone like I think people who like you who are watching this vlog right now you're getting the most like raw authentic version of myself even more than TikTok and I'd say TikTok is next, but, or maybe Twitch. I don't know. It's hard to say. Um, like live streams, but it's really, it's really cool because it's like you're in my day to day life with me. Like you are coming with me. And I just love, I love that. I think it's so fun. I've also enjoyed a lot of the editing process, which I've never actually loved before with YouTube. Um, I am like a little bit of a perfectionist and I am still trying to figure that out i actually have a lot of experience though with editing from doing gaming content for so long but yeah i am just like so excited it i don't know i can't explain it i just i love youtube i love it here's my little i guess i'll show you an ootd when we get down there i forgot to tell you guys that with my matcha i actually put in six packets of heart and soil colostrum i need to clean up the living room and just do like a tidy um oh oh my gosh i have to show you guys this really quick dibs beauty i tried them they sent me some of their stuff and i've been wanting to try their brand for a long time i don't know why it's not sold at sephora like we need dibs beauty at sephora i'm sorry i actually just saw my phone today 
that Salt and Stone is now sold at Sephora. They are one of my favorite brands. I'm so excited. They posted on it on Instagram, and I was like, thank goodness. Like it's about it's about time. <laughs> Oh yeah, I actually need to post a video really quick. Yes. Right now, I'm gonna show you the It Girl products that you definitely. I love going into Sephora and doing like hauls and telling everyone like the best stuff, because as a content creator, I get sent so much PR and I try stuff, and like if it sucks, I'm gonna tell you, and if it's good, I'm, I'm gonna tell you. I did a Smasher Pass one time at Sephora, and I need to do those videos more because there's a lot of beauty products I absolutely hate and I think they suck. So. Like, I, I need to tell you so that you're informed so you don't spend $40 on a setting spray or whatever that's, like, garbage. Because there are some out there that I'm, like, girl, I swear this is, like, wet and wild from the 2000s. Like, there's, it's serving absolutely nothing. That might even be being nice. My videos going to, this is my TikTok, going to Costco and, like, going into Sephora and just shopping, they get, like, hundreds of thousands of views and i'm like why sometimes even millions <laughs> and it's so funny to me because i don't get it but i'm like i think it's because you can tell i'm so passionate and i think people could feel that through the camera like i'm like no don't buy this or like yes like you need this but yeah like this one i did at sephora has 861,000 views right now, and i'm gonna do a little it this girl one. all right down to the basement we go i was just exporting my sephora video that mirror right there is so cute i actually think i'm gonna put it in my closet okay you guys are you ready to see the gym i'm gonna bring you over here i'm gonna open up these blinds <gasps> oh i think i might have just turned it off do you love it do you love it for mommy the tone machine is the best machine i've ever used in my entire life <laughs> Landmarks and all that kind of stuff. I'm gonna add some salts. 
<laughs> I'm gonna add some salt onto the tomatoes as well. Toast. I'm gonna add a little bit of lemon on top as well, and then I'll top it off with a little bit of pepper. Really tiny bit. Wow. <laughs> My vlog, it is actually the next day. I'm gonna curl the lashes. Maybe do a little bit of concealer on these acne scars because I can never stop picking at my face. I love that. And then we're gonna do a big PR unboxing. Glow Recipe sent me six bottles of their new, um, it's their water watermelon glow niacinamide hue drops. It's literally like the drunk elephant drops basically, but glow recipe and it smells it smells so good if you guys didn't know i recently started doing this thing where i just like dm people who follow me and comment on my tiktok videos and instagram reels and respond to stories and all that kind of stuff or just watch stories i offer to send them like a pr box of goodies before we get started also i ordered this skims top it was on sale and i am like in love i'm in love with it I got it in an oatmeal color too. Why am I so out of breath after literally just walking up the stairs? This is my favorite drink. It's orange juice and raw cow's milk. Such a game changer. The best drink for hydration. I don't know why I'm so out of breath, but wow. Crazy thing about these PR packages is this is only from Thursday to today. And I just got another one. So I'm gonna open up the one that just arrived. Oh yeah! You smell all the things. I used this a few times actually and I love it with their Velveteen shampoo. It's called Smooth Over if you struggle with frizz at all. It is like seriously amazing. Like I, I'm obsessed with it. I'm never gonna shut up about it because it's incredible and I think the Velveteen shampoo is actually my favorite. This is so cute. Oh my gosh. Okay, well now I have two, so it looks like we have to put this in the giveaway pile. It's for all hair types, too. Do you just want to be the star of the show? <laughs> you just want to be the star? I'm cool with that. I'm cool with it, girl. I'm cool with it. This is Prada's new lipstick. Prada Balm. This is universal. This is giving, like, YSL. I wonder if it's owned by the same company. It's kind of giving... YSL, what did I just, wait, what? Did I open that wrong? Oh, I did. Oh, wait, what? Maybe it's supposed to like screw in. Decided to try that out. I already have lip product on or else I would try it right now. By Sammy Ryan. Their brand is so cute. Tara, we hope you love these goodies. These goodies make you smile. That's so cute. Okay, that's adorable. This smiley, whoa. This smiley face is so fun. Let's see what's inside. Keychain and what is this? Oh, that's fun. They're like little cards. I'm grateful for each breath embracing with oh, embracing life with open arms. Crew neck too. Oh, this is a t-shirt. Just kidding. Whoa. This cleansing balm is my favorite. Wait, this is so cute. It's velvet. That's so fun. I love it when brands send these because I actually use them. <laughs> Like, I got this one in the mail from a brand, and I use it all the time. It's so cute. Cleansing balm right here is absolutely incredible. I definitely also want to give this away to one of you guys to try. I can't get it out. It's stuck. <laughs> I've never tried their resurfacing pads, but I'm sure this whole combo is amazing. K18, we have their Leave-In Molecular Hair Repair Mask. I love this stuff. It's... This mask is amazing. I'm very excited to open up this one because I actually tried to buy it and I it was out of stock. So you all know we love the Summer Fridays Lip Butter Balm. How does it look? Is it cute? Oh my gosh, that's so cute. It says happy birthday and it has an SF on the front of the letter an early an early birthday treat six years of summer fridays okay that's actually crazy that the brand's only been around for six years we feel incredibly grateful for your support since we launched in 2018 with our jet lag mask the product that started it all more than anything it's the con 
constant passion we feel from our community that fuels everything we create for you. Okay, cute. It's the little duo. Literally, this is like what their brands are known for are these two products. Limited edition lip butter balm and birthday cake. It smells so good. Little sparkles in it. I don't even know if you can see because they're so tiny. But it has mini sparkles. That's adorable. It's so cute. Hi, Goop. How are you? They sent so much good stuff. Oh, we got a girly pop thing. <laughs> if you know, you know. If you don't, you're too young. Cloudberry Exfoliating Jelly Cleanser. Thank you, Goop. Hi, Ardo. How are you? Charlotte Tilbury. The Super Nudes Airbrush Bronzer. Hot Kiss Lipstick. Beautiful Skin Foundation. Contour Wand. This filter, a must, a need. Iconic Nude Lip Liner. That's my favorite liner from them. And a foxy brown lip liner. I've actually wanted to try foxy brown. Hey. Is she not literally the cutest dog you've ever seen in your entire life? The, she does this all the time. She just put her hand like that. They smell so good. I ordered these new yoga mats for my gym. Love how chic and like clean looking these mats are. You guys, a squatty potty is the best thing ever. I get these like aesthetic ones. They're like, this one's a black wood color, but it's so good for your colon, which I feel like a lot of people don't think about when you're young. So it just helps you go to the bathroom. If you don't have a squatty potty, get one. I'll link mine below. I love this one. I have, let's see, I have one, two. I think this is my third one in my house. I need to get one for every single bathroom, so now all the main bathrooms have one. Revolution Makeup. They sent over an eyeshadow kit, some face and body glow. Ooh, I want to try this. I love this. Sol de Janeiro makes one of these, and I love it. I think this is, like, from a, few, a while ago, because I feel like this is, like, New Year's or Valentine's named. Ceramide Shimmer Lip Swirl. Yeah, this is definitely like from a long time ago. I found this in my husband's office and I was like, how long has that been there? He's like, I don't know, a few months. And I was like, oh, I bought kitchen gloves. Because <laughs> when I do the dishes, I do the dishes in the house and I don't, I like really hate touching the water. So how cute are these? We got purple, pink, and green. I just got done cuddling with Nova and now I might be covered in dog hair, so love that um i'm gonna take her over to the dog park to just run around hang out i'll probably just take her and throw her ball with her for a little bit you excited i know because you love chasing i can just guess just where they got dropped off all right, Nova. Let's go to the park. Ready? Wait, I didn't get it. I'm done. Go, 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 go. You want your ball? Speak. <laughs> Good girl. Nova pulled so hard on the leash that I literally dropped my camera. Wow, you're super fast. Are you ready? Drop it. Speak. More packages in the mail, so I'm gonna open them before I go do my workout and then put the boxes in the garage. Hourglass. Whoa, baby. So pretty. Thank you, Hourglass. I'm obsessed with Hourglass. Love their stuff so much. It's like a red lip, it's a scalp revival from Briogeo. Beauty Blender Ocean and Micro Mint for precise application. Thank you so much, Beauty Blender. I love this blue color. It's so fun for like spring and summer. Three, I'm excited to try this. I love T3 styling wands. I love their blow dryer. 
curling iron. I would say this is my favorite brand and I like the Nano. It's like this blue Nano I think is the brand. I like that brand too. Just got done with a workout. I'm sitting outside with Novo right now. Um, I did a Pilates workout. I like did not get good sleep last night. So I was like, if I can just do like a 20 minute Pilates workout with ankle weights, which is so much harder than I always think it's going to be. And then I did a sauna session for 20 minutes as well. So a nice like 40 minute wellness slash workout situation. My little brother just got here. He's helping me with a few house tasks, like setting up, um, him and Colby are setting up our frame TV, which I'm really excited. It's going in the office. So it's going to Colby's office. We have one in the living room right there that you can see. Um, so the new frame TV is gonna be so cute in Colby's office and I'll show you guys what that looks like. I think my cousin Daisy is supposed to, I think she might be coming over today or tomorrow to drop off her sourdough starter, which I'm really excited about because I'm so excited to learn how to make sourdough bread. Like I have all the things, I just need a starter. I have like, the I got a bunch of flour, I got, I have my Le Creuset, like I literally have everything. So I'm very, very, very excited about that. I know. I especially because last night. I'm not watching a series. to this place in Pleasant Grove. It's called Bonsai by Me. And you can make your own bonsai tree. Frozen steak, gonna put it in the air fryer. Um, I'll probably do it at 400 degrees for 17 minutes and then go from there. Maybe so. Alexa. Set a timer for 10 minutes. The audio was so loud and I was trying to tell you guys about the, my air fryer that I use. I literally use this thing every single day. It's amazing. It's kind of an investment for your kitchen, but if you get it, you will not regret it. So I'll link it down below. My brother is messing with the wires right now, so our frame TV is actually off, but it's usually always on. I'm sure you'll see it a million other times though. In other vlogs and things. My brother's on the phone, but look at this. How does he know how to do this? This is like literally being an electrician. Well, he's on the phone with, an, with his friend that's an electrician, but. My brain just. It doesn't, it does not work that way. I'm going to a birthday party tomorrow. I actually, oh, the lights just went out over here. I'm going to a birthday party tomorrow and. <coughs> hey, I just want to make sure, do you guys know that that light, oh, sorry. <laughs> that light right there won't be able to, you won't be able to turn it on from down here. Oh, only up there? Yeah. Because we're. Because this is the switch. That goes to the, that light right in the stairwell. Oh, to move the light switch? Yes. Yeah, so oh, I see. Well, yeah, so in order for, if you want to cover that up, uh -huh. this one's not a big deal because you can just go to that one. Yeah. But the one to upstairs, you have to go upstairs to turn it on and off. Why didn't they just put all three right there? Yeah. I mean, I wish we could have a light down here, but yeah, don't worry about it for now. So, <clears throat> Mondays, 
Oh, okay. So what I'm thinking is, I'm going to patch it, throw the wires in, and then if you guys find that you're like, wanting to turn that light we on, we want it. Tell them, then you can just pull yeah. Wires That's a good way to do it. I've been wanting at some point inside of the sun merging thing, but we do all the lighting right here because, uh -huh. like, just for instance, why, like, those. Um, like, we right never there, use those right there, those three, ever. <laughs> so kind of what I'm thinking is just at some point it can be a bigger project to yeah, do all these and, and yeah like upgrade just make the lights look prettier. It's also possible to consider upgrading so they're on a on a dim, you know, doing a little oh, yeah, dimmer. dimmer. Yeah. Looks so good. I'm really craving some raw ice cream, so this is literally all I put in it. We're going to do strawberry tonight, so strawberries, raw cream, raw milk, and some raw honey. I have to remember my measurements. I have them in a cookbook. Do one cup of strawberries. Half a cup. Honey, one cup of milk, and then a half a cup of cream. The cream really just makes it taste so much better because it thickens it up and makes it super creamy. too much though. Just enough to mix it. I want to like still have strawberry chunks if I can. Okay, let's see how that is. Mm -hmm. Yes ma'am. You guys, I just tried it. Um, it's even better than I remember. It is so good. This is literally perfect. Like this is the best strawberry ice cream I have ever had. Ever. It's just so beautiful. Justin, is Colby turning you into an alcoholic? Justin says he likes drinks, Sarah. He likes what? He likes trying drinks. Oh yeah. I'm getting my brother some ice cream. You gotta come try this ice cream. Yeah, we'll be right there. My camera's gonna die. Okay, I'm bringing it to him. It's taking too long. Oh my gosh, this is such a vibe. What the heck? What? Why did you invite me to your party? <laughs> we're, 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 we're testing. Okay, one sec. I gotta get you. I gotta. Okay, Justin. Let me know how it oh, is. Oh man, dude, sparkling makes it so much better. This is my first time having it. Okay, fine. Do you like this one or do you like the date one better? Oh, you're watching Killers You don't know which one? I feel like I might like the date a little bit more. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just kidding, I don't care. I mean, we all know Colby likes that one better. Yeah. Nova, are you a strawberry girl with mommy? Uh, no, she's like, a mistake girl. It also, oh, like, you know, it, it could be just... Yeah. Look at Colby's bar set up. This is the messy. Frame TV, I know it's messy, but like we're gonna get built-ins over here, and I don't know where were we doing this wall. We're we just painting this wall. Yeah. Here, oh okay, yeah, painting these that wall. These will have these will have bottom drawers, books, and a painting in the middle. 
Yeah, and then this is this was his idea. It was just so genius to get a frame TV in here, so like he can, you know, it's got. I don't think we have an Apple TV. Do we have an Apple TV on this, Colps? I don't think it has an Apple TV. You don't have an Apple TV on this, do you? Not yet. We need to get one. 